Some alarming new details about the homeless who walk Austin streets. Many of them recently had jobs. That's what volunteers discovered while counting the area's homeless today. It's part of an annual survey to determine how much federal funding Travis Connie will get to take care of the homeless. Jacqueline Inglaze joining us live from the studio with more. David, volunteers have been combing parts of Travis County since 3 o'clock this afternoon. Now, last year, more than 2,300 people in our area were categorized as homeless, and volunteers are expecting to see a similar result this year. Where did you become homeless? Here in Austin? No. 27-year-old Zach Long has been living on the streets for 14 months. Um, he lost his job in Ohio and moved to Austin, well, making this the first time he's okay. part of Travis County's annual homeless count. It doesn't seem like someone like me, out of prison, GED can really get too good a job too easily. Long's situation, according to volunteers canvassing the area, is an emerging trend among the homeless. What we're seeing is a lot of individuals who have lost their jobs. They're homeless because of economic reasons. Clark says only a few of the homeless people she's encountered are on the streets because they're mentally ill, drug addicts, or veterans. Three things most often associated with homelessness. Have you ever served in the U.S. military? No. More than 150 trained volunteers looked under bridges and along the lake for homeless people. Those searches turned a little, but parks and the Occupy Austin camp at City Hall is where Clark found the bulk of Austin's homeless. About 10 to 12 um, individuals at Occupy Austin were not homeless. Volunteers really are taught it. how to spot they, um, someone who was homeless and how to initiate a conversation with them. Okay. And while the results may not be 100% accurate, the count is necessary. Have we have to do a count and we have to turn in the numbers, but we have to do it to get the HUD funding. Many... Long believes that the count shows local leaders in care the... about the less fortunate. Being homeless here is unlike being homeless in any other city I've been to. There's plenty of food, people are polite, nice, they don't ignore you.